All right, everyone. So this video is going to be the first day on the doze of the 2022 season, and it's going to feature one of my muntjac catchers. Uh, if you want to know a bit more about them, just wait till the end. Otherwise, enjoy the video. Starting on for a new morning. So it's first morning at doe season in Scotland. What are we after, other than does? Does, Anything in does. particular? Just does. <laughs> does. And does. More does. As long as they're female. Right. That's all we need. And if you like, technical your stuff, that. You must subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> right. Everybody. Oh, just rifles in back, and then we're sorted. Yeah. Yeah. They're away. Cool. Right. Up to the top end because wind's coming across this way, so we're going to the far end of the ground. Them trees, yeah, it's definitely one there. Yeah, there could be two. I can see also one on three binos. Now, there's definitely two. I've got two in thermal, so we'll just hang here. There's another one to the left. See the lone pine tree, so 20 yard in where them branches are just behind them branches. There's three little pine trees on the road that side of that circle. Thank you. 
Mark. Probably say she's in this ditch here. Looking up. She's made over that stump, look. Say it on the other side ditch, which I'm surprised at. Yeah, we just don't want to. That other one should just be the way that stick sticking up. It's just the other side, that somewhere. That's where the last bit of blood is. Or I'll just yeah, some there. Looks like she's run through there. Just love clear fells. They're perfect. How the hell? Just she down. kept running. That's exit wound. On the rough ground as well. It's pretty, <coughs> pretty right. impressive. Let's go find number two. Believe how much blood she'd expelled there, can you? Yeah, and still get from here to cover of it, of it rough. All right, here we go. You got it, it's just here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Not everybody's cup of tea doing a headshot, but we're here to do a job, aren't we? Exactly. We'll take the shot that presents itself. I hate, I hate dragging on gravel. <laughs> Does me nutty. Just getting this one bled and then tied off. Perfect two doe kids.
tied off it. There we go, perfect. Beautiful. Quick check. Now your knife, this munch jack catch it, is actually perfect for this. Look at that. That's why, out. that's why I use it on nearly every day, even from them reds and fallow last week. I'd say this knife now has done. 60 plus deer. And I bet I've stropped it probably its fourth time. Yeah. It all came up here. Oh, and it's good. still holding its edge. But admittedly, I won't use it on its feet. I yeah, you're not using it, it running against the bell. Yeah. I've got a nice back at truck for that. I'm still wanting to do. Yeah, yeah. Still wanting to. Put it me. guides it a lot better. But you can do it straight through when it I don't you've got no chance of nicking out. Perfect. If anything, for me, I know it's for a neck one, but I'd probably want the handle same as that and probably have the blade same. Yeah. So it's like a matching pair. Yeah, I've done pairs I mean in my last video and it worked same. Yeah, yeah, he's still where we parked up, yeah. Yeah, we, we're still on that same clear file. How are you? Yeah, 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 we've only, we've only gone round. I'm going to stay in these tubes just once in a minute. Yeah. All right, mate. We'll get... Just let me know when you're done, then. All I've got to do is, like, walk up and over to that anyway. Yeah, all right, we'll turn you shot. Yeah. See you in a bit. Bye, 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 bye. Yeah, bye. Oh. Here we go. Back to what we were saying before. If you like and subscribe, you won't get a free. You don't get free stuff. Come scarf, on, I'm a Yorkshireman. But we have now two does down, so the scarf's all working again. <laughs> yeah, that's it. The um, the curse is broken. Right, we'll move on to the next clear pal. Right, thanks for watching that. Now to give you a bit more info on my muntjac catches. Right, so here are a pair of muntjac catches. Both of them I've made with what I call my Kybrid sheath. So basically, this has got a, a Kydex liner and then a leather outer on it, just to give it a bit more of a traditional look to them. Uh, both of them dyed in dark brown. Uh, this one's got some red stitching on it to match up with the red G10 liners on there. And this one has got some black stitching, again, match up with the black G10 liners. So I'll start off with this one. So the reason I call them catchers is the handle shape. So this particular handle shape, I've used it on a few different knives, and that is what I call my catcher. Now the blade is the muntjac version, so it's a long, thin blade, ideal for getting in, as you'll probably seen on the video, getting around the back end to be able to cut the anal tract out. I always say it's cutting its arsehole, but John always tells me off. Uh, the handle on this one is Massa Birch or Curly Birch, and it's got some brass pins in there, and like I say, it's got the uh, black G10 liners. So, back into the sheath. Uh, the leather outer is connected to the Kydex inner with some Chicago screws. These Chicago screws you can take off uh, and that allows you to remove the Kydex from the centre. You can wash that out separately and then put it back into the leather outer and bolt it back in. So this one is really something special. Uh, it's got a dyed maple burl handle, brass pins and the blade is Damasteel. So it's a patterned Damascus or a stainless Damascus. So two different steels that get etched away and they etch at two different rates. So one of them will etch away a little bit more or quicker. So it allows the, the pattern within the steel to really pop. So there we go, that's both sides of it. I made a few recently with the Damascus steel handles. They'll all be on my website. So thank you very much for watching guys. Uh, I'll try and get another video up soon and I'll see you next time.